stunning. It doesn't get any better than that. Welcome to Quick Set with me, Andy Bodfish, stepping in for Clayton Lucas. First things first, let's talk about that brilliant match yesterday between Brazil and the United States. Aaron Russell and Team USA silenced the Brazilians in their own backyard. A brilliant win, and that means that they end the Brasilia pool undefeated with four wins from four. It's going to be an intense day of action here at the VNL with a lot of key matches to follow on VolleyballWorld.tv. First up, it's a huge matchup between European rivals and a clash between the reigning world and Olympic champions as Poland take on France. The last time they met, it was a huge matchup at the Tokyo Olympics last year. Unger Pet and Le Bleu triumphed in an epic five-setter and eventually went on to claim the Olympic gold medal. Followed by another instalment in the long-standing Asian rivalry between Iran and Japan. The last time they met, it was the final of the Asian Championship last year in Chiba. And Iran, with Milad Ibaripour and company, denied Japan a victory in their own backyard to be crowned kings of volleyball in Asia. Finally, it's Italy against Argentina. The last time they went head-to-head, -head, it was the Olympic quarter-final in Tokyo last year. And Argentina got a stunning upset victory against Gianelli in Italy. Today is the final day of week one of the men's competition in the VNL. The men resume on June 21st through June 26th with two pools in Kazan City, Philippines and Sofia, Bulgaria. The top eight teams will go through to finals week in this year's VNL, which will be held this year in Bologna, Italy. You can follow every spike, tip, ace and block here on VolleyballWorld.tv and look out for all the stats on VolleyballWorld.com. That's all from Quick Set for today. Until next time, bye-bye. <laughs>